What's happening, my curious bunch of health fanatics? A process that your body must undergo to stay young and steer clear of disease is autophagy. Autophagy is the recycling of cellular components that may have become redundant. Your cells can actually reuse and recycle proteins and other worn out cellular parts so that the body becomes more efficient at using whatever resources may be available to become more energy efficient. In fact, amyloid proteins that can accumulate inside the brain, which may cause conditions such as Alzheimer's disease, can even be recycled through autophagy and made into useful biological machinery. The word autophagy means self-eat. If cellular junk is not being processed or removed from your cells, you end up with senescent cells, which are kind of like zombie cells, which misfire and cause all types of localized problems in the surrounding tissue, including chronic diseases. The million dollar question is, how do we activate autophagy or the autophagic pathway? Well, fasting is one way to activate autophagy and then suppressing the mTOR pathway with metformin or rapamycin is another way. If you are unsure of what metformin or rapamycin are, then visit my online course at www.scienceofaging.life. But fasting combined with metformin or rapamycin are powerful ways to activate autophagy and ensure that cells do not become senescent and dysfunctional in the first place. Remember that metformin is a calorie restriction mimetic, which helps trick your body into thinking it is fasting. I fast for 18 hours each day with no food before lunchtime or after 6 p.m. and I also use a fasting mimetic. Lifting weights or resistance training can initiate autophagy and also regular exercise, but it has to be regular, not once a week. Hyperbaric oxygen therapy has also shown to inhibit the mTOR pathway, which can also induce autophagy. Data also indicates that nutritional ketosis can activate autophagy in the liver and also in the brain. And I'll link to a video on ketosis at the end of this one. Sleep can also induce autophagy, and it is worth knowing that it is during sleep that much of your body cleans out cellular junk including beta amyloid plaques that are implicated in Alzheimer's disease, so sleep is extremely important for health and longevity. The heat shock response can induce autophagy as well, but can also interfere with the autophagy process if cells are too hot or the therapy goes on for too long. More research is currently being conducted in that area. But also cold exposure can also induce autophagy, such as cryotherapy or cold plunges. I'll link to another video on hot and cold exposure at the end of this video. But as always, check with your doctor first about anything you see online. It is worth knowing that the lysosome is the cellular machinery inside the cell that is responsible for recycling waste proteins and products into useful parts. Lipofusion is the name given to this cellular junk that goes on to inflict damage on our cells, causing them to go senescent and ultimately damage the surrounding tissues. Lipofusion may consist of poisons such as metals, which may include aluminium, copper, iron, mercury, zinc, etc. Lipofusion may also contain sugars and lipids among many other products. Many of these things can be recycled into something useful, but if they sit dormant inside the cell, they can cause major problems as well. The concept of recycling has been happening for billions of years and takes place millions of times a day inside your body. So next time someone asks you to recycle that plastic bottle by using the recycling bin, know that this is an important mechanism for life to exist and a good deed worth doing. Remember, your health is your number one asset and aging is the number one cause of disease. Ask yourself, how often do you invest in your health, your number one asset? So if you're interested in aging and how to slow stop or reverse facets of it, then I urge you to invest in your health and do my online course, www.scienceofaging.life. And as a YouTube follower, you can use the discount code I have put in the details below for a very limited time to receive a 30% discount. Investing in your health is the best investment you can ever make. Just ask anyone with the onset of a preventable disease if they wish they had invested more in their health. My course is just a quick video course with 10 lessons which will enable you to feel and look younger and most of all become disease resistant. Back to proteins. Proteins can either be structural or machines 
that do work or enzymes that cause biochemical reactions. And autophagy recycles the protein building blocks, which are amino acids, back into other functional proteins or structures. This is why autophagy is so important. Please subscribe, smash that thumbs up button, or face the consequences of your actions. Until next time, stay young and stay vibrant.